sports and 41 athletes, 23 men and 18 women have been named in a powerful Kenyan team bound for next month's Tokyo Olympic Games following a three-day national trials that concluded this afternoon at the Moy International Sports Center Kasarani. Mukami Wambora with the details. As the curtains came down on the three-day athletics Olympic trials, the men's 1500 meters provided the biggest surprise of the entire trials. The reigning world champion Timothy Chariot failing to qualify after finishing a disappointing fourth. Charles Simotua was the unlikely hero as he destroyed a strong field to win in 3 minutes 32.75 seconds. Iten-based Kamar Etiang was second as Kipsang closed the podium. <laughs> Top Gun Helen Obiri will lead Kenya's charge in the middle distance races. Leading from gun to tape, Obiri clinched victory in the women's 10,000 meters in 30 minutes, 53.60 seconds, just two days after securing her first ticket in the women's 5,000 meters after finishing second. Of course, yes, I want to double because to me on our 5,000, you go first today. And uh, 10,000, it go musho musho. So I'm looking forward to double. So maybe probably if I were to one goal, I would be happy. In the 3,000 meter steeplechase, defending champion Conceslas Kipruto dropped off after an underwhelming race. Instead, Leonard Bett won ahead of Abraham Kibiwat, who slowed at the finish to allow his teammate to move on ahead and take the victory, with both men assured qualification for next month's games. Benjamin Kiget was third. I'm sure to manage. U.S.-based Michael Saruni, world bronze medalist Ferguson Rotic and Emmanuel Korir secured tickets in the men's 800 meters. Kenya enjoyed its most successful outing at an Olympics in Rio in 2016 after collecting 13 medals, 6 gold, 6 silver and 1 bronze. And the current roster of 41 athletes, 23 men and 18 women will look to beat that mark in Tokyo. Mukami Wambora for Citizen TV.